What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another Power video. If you're new, if you love Power, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like the video, and leave your comments, theories, everything down below. Now, today we will be talking about Power Season 6. It has multiple endings. Yes, Courtney Kemp has already confirmed this, that they filmed many different scenes, um, different endings, because, you know, leaks always get out. I mean, the last probably three years, it's been a leak. You know what I'm saying? The ending has pretty much been spoiled. So what they did was film different endings. Now, what do you guys think about this? How do you think this will play into the show? Most likely, it's going to be some type of leak. Um, as you can see, she left. She had the interview with a deadline. And you can see right here, she pretty much saying that they filmed different um, endings just in case some shit get leaked out. Now, do you think a leak is really going to um, affect the true ending of this show? You know what I'm saying? Like, how much can it affect it? In my opinion, this is my prediction, in my opinion. I believe that she has an ending, and if it does get leaked out, I think we're going to still see that ending. It's just going to be different. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's a different person that shoot ghosts or, you know what I'm saying, different events. But I think the 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 real ending that she has, she always had it. She has always had it, in my opinion. As you can see in this article, as I talked to you guys like a week ago, and I explained how she already had it in her head um, years ago on how power would end. And you can see it. It's right there in your face. I mean, Ghost has been shot. I mean, the initial ending, I think, in her head was Ghost dying. I mean, it, it makes sense to me. Now, the headline people are talking about is Ghost has been shot. So this is, this is the ending that she always saw, but she said she flipped it, she changed it. So I'm thinking as far as her changing it, I'm taking it, well, she just made it seem like she's going to make like a murder mystery out of it. You know what I'm saying? Because the first 10 episodes she already had in her head, she knew how it was going to end. But since we got five more to go, the ending is already here. We already done seen the season finale for real. All we got to do is wait and see who actually done the crime. So she took the last five episodes and turned it into a... Uh, um, a murder mystery and now remember what Courtney Kim said she said this these five episodes that's left is inspired by Rashomon um, it's an old old film um, you guys may know what exactly what it is I left it right here and it's pretty much it's it's um, about four people that give different versions of a man's murder so it's similar to ghosts. I mean, it's similar. You're going to see different viewpoints of how everybody's day was in those last five episodes. Like we only saw Ghost's perspective in the uh, final episode, which is episode 10. And with well, the last episode, the last five is going to be different perspectives, similar to Rashomon. So that's exactly what we're going to see in the last five episodes. To be honest with you guys, I think it's all just promotion just to stretch it out. Um, my opinion is this ghost is going to die. That's just how I see it. And I know a lot of people don't want that to happen. And I understand that. Trust me. You know, I don't want it to happen. I wish he could live. I hope I'm, hey, look, I hope I'm wrong. Um, I hope I am wrong, but everything points to him dying. I felt like she always had it in her head that he would die. She changed the ending just to stretch it out. In my opinion, to, make it fun you know what i'm saying they offered more money you know she got the new contract with stars everybody wanted more episodes so five more episodes to turn it into like a murder mystery guess who did this who shot ghost it's great promotion i mean it's pretty much dallas all over again who shot jr that's exactly what it is so to be honest with you guys having different endings already like filmed out i don't really think it's going to affect the fact that ghost most likely is going to die. You know what I'm saying? Now, this is just my theory, my prediction. I'm not saying I'm right. This is just what I think. I think he's going to die. I hope and pray that I'm wrong. But as I told you guys earlier, I think Courtney Kim already had it in her head on how this series, this book, chapter one or whatever, was supposed to end. And what she did was she gave us the, uh, an extra five episodes and she stretched the shit out. That's why we're not really going to see nothing new. We, I mean, we're going to see stuff new. We're just going to see it in the other characters' 
perspectives. We want to see what Tommy was doing, Tasha, Tariq, uh, Tate, Dre, all those guys. We want to see the different perspectives um, similar to the movie that she inspired the five episodes after of. It was just Rashomon. You see what I'm saying? So that's exactly what we're going to see. It's not like we're going to get a whole lot of new content as far as what happens next. It's not going to be a whole lot of that. We may get a little bit of what happened next, but it's not going to be uh, like it's not going to dive deep into the future, in my opinion. We're just going to get those different perspectives. What do you guys think? Do you think those different multiple endings is going to play a part? Do you think it's going to get leaked out and then those endings will come in? So to be honest with you guys, a lot of the spoilers and stuff that was getting put out early was false. I mean, it was a lot of stuff coming out. Y'all know what I'm talking about. A lot of stuff people saying all types of different crazy things, but a lot of that stuff did not come true. You know what I'm saying? A lot of that stuff didn't come true. It was spoilers talking about how Ghost was setting Tommy up and it was all, you know, a plan of his, him and Tasha and Tariq's. But we see it didn't come true. Um, now, if this leak, if another leak does come uh, come out in the future, what do you think is going to happen? Do you think the multiple endings will actually change the true ending? And I'm talking about the true ending of Ghost being shot and possibly dying. I think he's done for. I don't think it's going to really play that a part like that. If anything changes, it's probably the person that shot Ghost or maybe different events happen. But the end result is your boy Ghost is probably going to die. Um, or maybe he ends up in a wheelchair, as you can see in the thumbnail. Um, everybody was making jokes about this. And I decided to put it in the thumbnail. But that would be crazy if he does not die and he ends up in a wheelchair. That would be crazy, man. Uh, people don't want to let your boy Ghost go. Um, that just shows how great Omari is as an actor, man. He played the hell out of James St. Patrick, man. But um, you guys let me know, man. What do you think of those multiple endings? And do you think it's going to play a part? And leave all your predictions down below. I will be dropping another banger for y'all tomorrow. We ain't getting power until January 5th. But best believe I'm going to keep y'all updated. I will still break down all these characters as far as... Um, who shot goats? I started off with Paz. So if you didn't see that video, make sure you go and watch um, why Paz shot ghosts, or pretty much, or do you think Paz shot ghosts? I made a video breaking it down. The other characters, they are coming soon. I will drop another one for you guys tomorrow. So be ready for it because it's going to be a banger. And the video that I'm going to drop tomorrow is actually going to be my prediction on who shot ghosts. So be ready for it. But keep supporting your boy, and I will continue to bring you more power content in the future. But it's your boy, Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.